Val, why are you hiding in the closet? Because the last thing I need is for my organs to be rearranged! Oh, huh, funny. I would've thought you would've been into that. Now's not the time for your jokes, Fox! <laughs> right. Well, if you need me, I'm going to... Oh. So, me and you can do this the uh, easy way or the hard way. You can either scoot to the side there so I can talk to him, or... You can feel the same amount of pain I'm going to give you. <laughs> Listen, I don't know who you think you are or how you even got past all of my uh, inventions that were supposed to stop you, but I'm not letting you go anywhere near me. I'm afraid he's a bit more important than uh, whoever you seem to be. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You don't know who I am, do you? Not in the slightest. Vax, I'm going to need you to stop talking now. You mind giving me your hand for just a second? Oh boy, Vax! All right. <laughs> Thank you. Ow, 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 ow. That, that, is, that is horrible. That is horrible. What? Ow, is that? Ow. That is enough angelic energy to level two fucking planets. Reduced by a very small margin. How small are we talking? He's about a clean zoo, zoo, zoo. Who gives up? Uh, right. <laughs> He's all yours. Fox! See you later, Bell. I'll remember you fondly. There you are, you filthy little moth. Listen. God, whatever this is about, I'm sure we can come to a reasonable understanding. The contract with Anthony, I want it terminated. Anthony, you, <laughs> you made angel dust. Of course, terminated. I I end of story. Well, I will never bother him again. This was all this was about? Yeah, I'm so quite glad you decided to agree. <laughs> you know... I almost thought this was about Mia uh, licking and kissing my granddaughter's arm. About what? You know, I'm kind of shocked you didn't mention to him about uh, Valentino and Charlie's arm. Oh, I wanted to. Trust me. Big time, pussycat. I wanted to. But I know Valentino way too well. That clown is gonna sit there and tattle on himself. When he does, that's gonna be a huge bomb right in his own fucking face. Every day I find ways to respect you. Alistair, I have a question for you. Ah, Carmilla, I'm assuming this has to deal with where I've been for the past seven years. No, not at all. I'm still not interested. I'm just curious as to why it is that the Heavenly Father is with you here today. Ah, well. His granddaughter asked me to take him out, so I figured I'd let him come and see what it is that I do every once in a while, instead of just sitting around the hotel doing nothing. Ha <laughs> ha This coming from the person who stands around smiling all the time. Ha ha ha! This coming from the person who drinks wine and gossips with the patrons all day. Ha ha ha! This coming from the person who has a dungeon on the hotel until I showed up. Ha ha ha! Gentlemen, if you please. Camilla, forgive me for being late, old friend. I. Heavenly Father. Zestual, old friend. How art thou? Thine concern for my own being has improved my day tenfold. Well, it is the least I can do for the most respectable individual here within hell. I'm sorry, did I, uh, 
Say something funny, miss, uh... My name's no concern of yours, old man. Now that sheer form of aggression and attitude, my assumption is that you must be the third of those thieves. Tell me, how is dear Valentino? Well, if you must know... <laughs> Still broken from your last visit. Fucking piss baby won't stop whining about it. Well, good. That means he hasn't forgotten me. And he never will. Though you and I don't get along, you're going to have to tell me every detail on that. Trust me, you too, and I gladly will. Hey there, click here for my recommendation for you to watch. Or click here for my personal favorite. This one is important, click this and don't forget to turn on the bell. So you get notified on my newest upload. Done. Thanks. Here, have a hug. <laughs>